Well, hello, everybody. It is time for Goofy Grandpa Classroom class. I'm glad to be back here. I didn't think anybody would come back and show up, but you did. I'm so glad. I'm so glad. So, we got a big one today. The other day, I started with the letter B. I should have started at the beginning, but I didn't. So, let me go back and work my way backwards. And today, we're going to be the letter A. The letter A. This is the most important letter in the whole damn world. The letter A. Letter A. It's the first letter of the alphabet, the Greek alphabet, alpha, alpha. A, and it is the most important. It's important, you know, you hear, you want to be on the A list. You want to get an A while you're in school, right? You want to get an A. You don't want to get a D like Grandpa got all the time. <laughs> you want to get an A. Uh, it makes um, the sound A, it makes the sound ah, it makes the sound ah, that A. Um, it's important. Your doctor always says, uh, open up your mouth and say, ah, ah, right? He don't tell you to open up your mouth and say, mmm, or Arr. He makes you say, ah, very important, very important that A. Um, Canadians say A all the time. A, want to go to play some hockey, A? Uh, Italian people. Italian people said put in that practically put an A after every single word. I had a cellmate named Tony. He used to say all the time, he used to say, I'm gonna kill her, that son of a bitch with my bare hands. Right? A. That's a very important letter. Very important letter. And the Fonz, man, the Fonz. What would the Fonz be without A? The Fonz didn't say Q or M. The Fonz always said A. Very, very, very important letter, the letter A. So we're going to spend some time today. We're going to go over some words that begin with A. And probably one that most people know right off the bat. This is uh, one that you learn very early on. They tell you one of these day, one of these a day. Keeps the Grim Reaper away. And that is apple. Apple begins with an A. Apple. The A ah sound. App sound. Right? And that is one of these right here. Apple. Huh? What do you say? What? What do you say? What are you saying in the back there? I know the same. I know. No, this ain't an apple. This is an art. You can't find an apple in the store. It is so crazy out there. Apples, you can't even find them. You can't find toilet paper. You can't find chicken. You can't find disinfecting wipes. You can't find... You can't find... Spam and need a hand spamatizer. You can't find that. And for the life of me, I can't tell you why there is absolutely no black beans on the shelf. I tell you, did Guns and Ammo magazine put out a special recipe for the end of the world? Black bean survival casserole in last month's issue of the magazine? Nothing. You can't find a black bean in the whole entire store. It's very upsetting. But what you can do. So I didn't have an apple. I'm sorry. Gave you an orange. What can I say? But you know, everybody knows what an apple looks like. God, what do I have to show you one for? Okay. A. They tell you people, places, and things. Right? This is a place. This is a place. Alabama starts with an A. Alabama. Sweet home, Alabama. 
coming home to you. I hope Neil Young will remember. Don't need no southern man around. Alabama. Hey. Okay. Alabama. People, places, uh, people. Oh, boy. I have a friend. He's been a friend a long, long time for Goofy Grandpa. He's been the best friend of mine. He's with me every single day. His name begins with A. His name is Al. Al. Cohal. Al Cohal. Yes, <laughs> Al Cohal. He is my best. He is one good friend of mine. I tell you, and there's so many different kinds and varieties. You got your beer. You got your wine. You got your liquors. You got your hard cider. You got your soft cider. You got your girly salsa stuff that they got nowadays. But I tell you, my f absolute goddamn favorite alcohol is is my backyard made in the USA hooch, which I just happen to have some right here. I got some with me all. Hey, and you know it's time for my two o'clock dose. I, just give me. We got a station identification break here for a second, there, people. The children, just hang on one second. Boo-hoo! Boy, <laughs> whoa, that, boy, that'll put some nuts on, kick you right in the nuts. I, t I tell you, if you ain't got any nuts, you'll get some nuts after you drink that stuff, boy. I tell you, that is some good stuff. Okay, now, what's the next, what's the next word on our list here? We got, must have another word here. I think it has to do with the last word. Starts with an A. A inebriated. That is something that gra uh, Goofy Grandpa is a lot. A inebriated. I won't go into the details, but it's, uh, it's a fun state. Not a state of the U.S., but a state to be in. A inebriated. Okay. All right. We're almost done here. Almost done with the letter A. Almost done. We have a word here. This is a this is a thirty-five my what my daddy would call a thirty-five dollar word. This is a damn Einstein. Well, Albert, I, hey Albert Einstein. This is an Einstein size word. This is Einstein. Didn't he invent time? Didn't he do that? E A equals D M run D M C squared or something like that. Figured out time. Or was that the Rolling Stones? I don't know. Somebody. Anyway, this is a word I love saying this word. I don't know what the hell it means, but I love saying this word. I'm going to get it back here. This is anti-establishmentarianism. Disestablish anti-disestablishmentarianism. That is a word. Begins with A. I tell you, I haven't said that word since I came back from Vietnam, back to the U.S., it was back in the, in the 70s, man, uh, anti-disestablishmentarianism. Anyway, okay, so that's what we got for today. That's the letter A. That is the letter A, and I want to just end on a, on a note here and give you a little, give you a little advice to my classrooms, my, my young students here. Social distancing, that is something... You probably hear it all the time, social distancing, something you got to do. I know you want to kiss your mama. Don't do it. Stay. You got to stay six of these feet, six of these feet away. That means you on one side of the room and her on the other side of the room. And definitely when Uncle Phil comes over, you want to stay social distancing away from him, even if there is no coronavirus. That man has got wandering hands and hangs around Chuck E. Cheese too much. You stay away from him. Anyway, I just want to end with this and say that we are all the same. And I love every single one of you out there. It doesn't matter where you come from. doesn't matter where you're going. 
doesn't matter who you love. And it doesn't matter what particular shade you happen to be. We are all the same, and I love you. Kind of makes me want to sing. Makes me sing. All of me loves all of you. I think I might have something there. I'm going to get my guitar later and work on that one. That sounds like that could be a hit, I tell you. So I got one last day as we say goodbye. Ask the La Vista. Goodbye, and I will see you the next time. Have a great day, boys and girls. Stay healthy.